everyone, welcome to Center of Balance Live. I'm Sunan Poa from Center of Balance, the acupuncturist. Wow, tonight, today, I supposed to do this um, webinar sooner, but I was too busy. So, you didn't lock down. We're going to move to level three. So, in level three, next week, we'll be able to do. Um, online herbal consultation so we send out email and there's some of patient we book again so next week we're gonna see them online and then give them some herb and send out some herbs to them okay today uh, we're talking about uh, elbow pain elbow pain elbow pain right so how do you do elbow pain get a quick relief you know an instant relief I'm going to show you this later on. But before I say that, please, if you're on, <coughs> I have two cameras in front of me at the moment. One is my computer. So that's Facebook. So I do Facebook. We do Facebook live video every day on TikTok. Thank you for joining in. We don't do it on TikTok every day. If I happen to do the live video, I'm going to do it on TikTok. But if my colleague do that and they're going to do it just on Facebook page so on TikTok if you watch this video please if you want to receive the information more information more tips it's actually more on our Facebook page so how do you get to that um, go to the above to our page so like our first like and go to our page and above the Q&A there's a link Click it in so you can schedule if you're on Facebook you're our patient don't worry because all this will be recording in our Facebook page and if you want to watch previous recording and you need to ask for the link and all the links on TikTok so previously we have done a live video for tips for neck pain lower back pain knee pain and wrist pain and elbow pain is today so tomorrow we're going to do ankle pain hip pain the next day sciatic pain finger joints pain so all this thing we schedule one a day right so my colleague or i will do this uh, live webinar and show you a tips to get rid of all the pain then um Hi Nancy, thank you for saying hi. Thank you. So um, the race on the TikTok, yeah, go and sign up. And if you can't join us on that time, don't worry. We actually film it down and put it on YouTube, and we'll send you the link. As long as you sign up, we we'll send you the link, right? We we'll send you the recording link, right? So let's start now. For um. For this elbow pain, we need to ask you need to ask yourself, do you feel the pain right now? Any of you feel the pain right now? Please please say yes if you feel the pain. If you have have you suffered from elbow pain right now? You if you're not feeling any pain at the moment, that's okay. So what are you gonna do? You may have pain on and off during the week not every day probably when you use it do you have it do you have that pain sometimes if you have that please say yes because this is going to help you that help help you as well all right no matter where the pain is whether it's in here here or here now ask yourself if you have the pain right now ask yourself how bad is it out of 10 how bad is it out, out of 10? Now, 0 is nothing, 10 is the worst. Just ask yourself. Then, if you don't have pain right now, then you're going to do some movement. This is what you're going to do. Just do this. And turn. When you turn, straight your arm and turn. 
Do you have any pain? Can you feel any pain in here? Especially tennis elbow. Uh, if you have pain in there, please let me know. And ask yourself, how bad is it? So some of you may not feel the pain. It's just achy or it's just stiffness or tightness. Right? And then you do your arm like this. Just bend it and extend it. Flexion, flexion and extension. Just do this. Right. And then if you feel pain, ask yourself how bad it is. Okay? That's that simple. Right. Next, I'm going to show you how to locate the point. It's actually very, very simple. Right. We have two techniques. One is local point technique. The other one is distal point technique. Right. I can feel the pain now, elbow. Okay, good. You can test it out right now. Now, let me show you. If it's, if I have pain over here, I'm going to do use my finger and go and rub it, right? Or put heat pack on, right? Two things. Some of the pain when you rub it, you actually feel better, much better. That's good. Keep doing it every day. Now, if that doesn't work, or in other, it, in, with some people, it actually make it worse, right? When you rub it, it actually make it worse, much worse. And therefore, this strategy is not good for you. So local points is not good for you. So two outcome, one's very good, keep going. The other one, make it worse, stop it. Listen to yourself, right? Your body is amazing. It'll tell you whether it's to keep going or stop it. Does that make sense? All right. The next strategy is distal point. Before I go into the distal point, please give me a thumbs up and share this live video to your social media, right? Share, you can share it on TikTok as well. And tag the person. So you can add the person on TikTok who, if you think who need this live video, need some tips, please share with them. And the distal point is, I have pain over here. I can do some point over here. Because those connect to the organ, connect to the brain, correspond to the opposite side. Right? I can do some point on the knee to treat this as well. So what I'm going to show you, and this is just an example here and here. I can do others like head or fingers point for that as well. So this is example, just one example today that I'm going to show you is the opposite elbow. Very simple, very, very simple. Yes, I'm a sharer of your videos and messaging on Facebook. Thank you very much. So, look, so if I, are we still in winter in New Zealand? So look, if you bend your arm, most of the tennis elbow is over here. And it comes down to here, right? So exactly, if the pain is on the bone, on here, then you bend your elbow, go to the next, the opposite side on the bone and you press it over here quite press it hard a little bit and rub it and you'll find a very sensitive point exactly opposite on the same side or on the opposite side on the same spot right we hit the bone you hit the point just rub it at least 30 seconds just like that it's very simple right and after 30 seconds just move it now if if the the pain is just one spot then you're going to do one spot if the pain is about that then what are you going to do if the pain is over here from the bone on here up to here that big from here painful and here and about that big that area 
you're gonna go here and here and here then you're gonna use your thumb to press it like this oh my one is sensitive in here although I didn't have pain in there so if you had the sensitive point just go for 30 seconds and each point each point that you hit 30 seconds just like that all right just press it for 30 seconds now you can press it for 10 seconds and move 10 seconds 10 seconds 10 10 when you finish 10 give it a go if it's still painful you go for at least three sets so add it up each point 30 seconds does it make sense right <laughs> then what happened right now when you do that 30 seconds each point you must ask yourself though if the pain in some patient the pain is not just in here the whole arm the whole not the whole the whole elbow what do you do with the elbow elbow same thing what is the pain is whole elbow you go go to the opposite side and press the whole elbow pressing the whole elbow if you hit any point on the opposite side of the elbow some of you may not be able to pinpoint exactly where the pain the pain is just just all over just go all over it's that simple that makes sense that's that simple okay just go all over and hit all the points all right so some of you say that you have pain and now you practice it and move it tell me is it getting any better do you feel any better solution for early morning running nose <laughs> i can put it down it's that's not for today okay it is very simple you just get some ginger and liquors and cook it together and drink it in the morning and that should be able to help you drink it every morning and once at night time before bed as well once in the morning once at night time and you feel better with the runny nose it's so simple okay it's getting better now all right some of you can say better that's good that's good so for those just joining our facebook and tiktok right now what you can do is just uh for the, for the facebook you can rewatch that it's simple and for the tiktok please go to my page like it first and go to my page and go to uh, the link above the q a the wait one q a and click the link and there are a lot of webinar that you can click in and sign up and we'll send you the recording video All right simple so any of you in facebook that have any question from melbourne great good to see you thank you many thanks for all your work no problem no problem okay cool uh that's it for this okay now if i have time uh, another time because here is 10 20 i need to go to bed <laughs> so uh tomorrow i have um training uh for my team where i teach them uh how to prescribe the herbs and for i'm gonna set up um, some um, marketing course for my uh for my teams as well as my uh, uh, uh uh, my students and we're going to prepare for um, I, I've got some patient tomorrow uh, for online uh, consultation for herbs and we send herbs to them so if you're in TikTok uh, if you need any uh, help and we able to help you uh, we, can, we can go for online uh, consultation hey just uh, on the link you can on, on that link you can click in there's a, a website so you can send an email to us and we can organize uh, uh, online uh, uh, consultation for you guys and again it's not for everyone online consultations some of the disease we can't do online consultations if some of them if you if we pain we're quite confident and it's some internal disease we're quite confident but not all of them are suitable for online consultation if we tell you hey we're not comfortable with online consultation with your conditions i'm sorry we just we just can't and you have to come to a clinic all right stay awesome for today and thank you for 
you guys joining in in this very easy strategy and if you get relief please do it every day every day every day at least once a day and of course when you do it at least once a day the pain decrease decrease and you don't feel any more pain every day anymore and the pain come comes and go comes and go when you use it it comes when you use it it comes and you may come back and tell me hey it doesn't work because I still feel the pain but the pain, and and I always ask my patient then how often do you feel the pain right now they said well uh, once every two days whenever I use it I said well it's working now because you used to feel it every day but now it's just whenever you use it so which means you're not feeling pain all the time over here just whenever you use it so every day you keep going to release the point your aim is to get with all the sensitive point on the opposite side does it make sense and if you want to do it even better it's just once a day it's not good enough whenever you feel the pain give it another go does it make sense it's so simple it's so so simple then if you want to prevent it to come back please keep wrapping it until there is no sensitive point on the opposite arm okay and even better after you wrap here put a heat pack on the pain area it would help especially for chronic disease chronic pain then if you follow what i just told you you know it hasn't worked there's always come to two things one is structure issues there's a structure issue in there second is the organs the organs are very weak so all the meridian as i show you over here all the meridian here connect to organs so by pressing here we actually stimulate the organs get the function better and then push up more blood circulation in here but when you press here it hasn't got enough energy or it is not as strong to make the organ function better then therefore the function of your organ is still low then it can create more circulation to connect to that side to increase the circulation here to relieve the pain does that make sense then therefore when acupressure wise is not as well not it's not working as it should be there's structure issue and organ functional problem and therefore i suggest you go to your local acupuncturist and chinese medicine herbalist to seek help does it make sense right now if you happen in new zealand in auckland you can't see it clearly up there we have clinic in hamilton auckland raglan through canada right okay. so again leave your message down there or on TikTok, go to the link and click it in follow us first and go to our page on the top and there's a link and click in and go to our website and send us an email and we will help you book an appointment and come in all right what kind of liquid for the tea please ginger fresh ginger and liquid you have to get to chinese medicine's uh, clinic and buy some liquid or otherwise just use ginger the ginger will be fine and ginger with a, if you if you're not good with the uh, uh, the spicy of the ginger taste then you use you can add some uh, brown sugar or black sugar do not use white sugar not good for you brown sugar or white sugar just a little bit of brown or white sugar and drink it every morning one cup in morning one cup at night time right and that will warm up your stomach and spleen and as well as your lung and then it will stop your um, runny nose that was for the case okay stay awesome and today uh, is Friday tomorrow is Saturday and it's gonna be very busy and uh, even lockdown at home so you guys stay awesome and please share this live video with your friends and your families
and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Thank you.